I am so excited. I just got Cammie's new Thunder shirt in the mail. We're about to try it on her for the first time. Came in this package. Shipping kind of took longer than I thought it would. I didn't get an email saying that my order had shipped. So I kind of wasn't really expecting it to come yet because I didn't know it had shipped already. But anyway, it's here and we're really excited. So I just opened the package and her Thunder shirt came in this cute little pouch. Um, it has the logo on it. And I ordered her the pink shirt, which um, was about $5 more than the normal gray one. Um, and I chose not to have it embroidered just in case the size didn't fit. Um, Cami is, let's see, 18 pounds. And then I had to measure her. So I measured her from the top of her shoulders, the shoulder blades, all the way to under her, I guess her armpits, to measure her torso was about 18 inches. So um, I wasn't sure what size to do because um, the size chart looked like there were three different sizes that could fit her, but it, um, I wrote on Thundershirt's Facebook page and they told me that a size small would probably be the best. Um, so I ordered the pink because she's a girl and always gets confused for being a boy because she's black. Come here. Let's try and put this on you. Yeah, let's try and put it on. It's a little confusing. There we go. Okay, come here. Come here. Let's see if it fits. Yeah, let's see if it fits you. Huh? Does that fit? Come here. Good girl. Good job. You're doing a good job. Yes, you are. There. Now you've got it on. How do you like it? I can't really tell if she's more calm. She's wagging her tail, so that's good. Kind of confusing to put on at first, but I saw the diagram on their website, which helped. Cammie! I wonder how long I can leave this on her, because... Cammie's problem is separation anxiety. She yips and howls when I leave, and she's in her crate, but, um... She definitely doesn't like it when I leave her, which is every day for work. And today I got home and I could hear her yipping inside. I was like, oh, I hope she hasn't been doing that all day. I'm in an apartment, so it's definitely not good to have her yipping. I can't tell if she's upset or if it's doing the calming effect on her. She kind of looks sleepy. Now she's whining. That's not good. Why do you look unhappy? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> well, she's definitely acting subdued. Let's see how you do if we take it off. You get immediately active again. Good girl. Well, took the Thunder shirt off of her, and she is still kind of calm. So maybe it's not a good time to do it because I can't tell if she's actually being calmed by the Thunder shirt or if she's calm anyway at this time. It's hard to tell. So I'm going to have to try it again, maybe in the morning and see if she yips. That's a good idea. Maybe we can try that. But the thing is that I'm going to be gone for like nine hours for work, so I'm kind of nervous about leaving it on her for nine hours. I don't know about that. That's probably a bad idea. At least until I know if she's okay. When I get home, she's usually pretty active. We, you know, we just went on a little walk. She hurt her paw the other day, so she can't really walk too much. She starts limping. Sometimes she tends to sleep right now anyway, so 
but sometimes she's active, so it's hard. To, that's why it's really hard to tell. I don't know. I guess I'll have to update this video at that time. <laughs>